In Montana's top two political races this year, one for the U.S. Senate and the other for the U.S. House, the campaign ads are starting to come in fast and furious. MTN's Mike Dennison evaluates two recent TV ads from the incumbents in each of those races. And tonight, he takes a closer look at an ad from Democratic U.S. Senator John Tester. I have cancer. It's hard enough without worrying about how to pay for health care. This ad from the Tester campaign features freelance writer and photographer Paula McGarvey of Butte, who has fought breast cancer for a decade. It criticizes the health care record of Tester's Republican opponent, Matt Rosendale, who's the current state insurance commissioner. Here's more. Matt Rosendale pushed to let insurance companies deny coverage for pre-existing conditions. This claim is based on Rosendale's calls to repeal the Affordable Care Act, Obamacare, which forbids insurance companies from denying coverage, and for his support of more short-term plans, which can exempt coverage of pre-existing health conditions. Rosendale says even though he wants to repeal Obamacare, he would fight for reforms that protect Montanans with pre-existing conditions. The ad also says Rosendale rubber-stamped a 23% increase in health insurance premiums. Not really. As insurance commissioner, Rosendale can review proposed rates for individual health policies and say they're not justified. But the companies can file whatever rates they want. Last year, Rosendale held hearings and reviewed Blue Cross of Montana's proposed 23% average increase for individual policies. He did not officially object to the proposed rates and they went into effect. The Rosendale campaign says the ad doesn't mention Tester's 2010 vote for Obamacare, which Rosendale says has broken our health care system and led to a 133% increase in individual policies over four years in Montana. Those individual policies serve about 5 to 7% of Montanans. Most of these policies did see substantial increases in premiums from 2013 to 2017, but 85% of Montanans who bought them also got federal subsidies to offset the costs. This ad does take a few liberties, but it highlights a key issue in this campaign. The candidate's very different stance on health care policy. We'll be looking at that more closely in the weeks to come. Reporting from Helena, Mike Dennison, MTN News. And tomorrow, Mike will uh, focus on the first TV campaign ad from Republican Congressman Greg Gianforte.